Meanwhile, the Ghana Tech Lab has appealed to the government to support local innovators and startup businesses with tax waivers to help them grow their businesses and support the economy. Executive Director of the Ghana Tech Lab, George Apia, spoke to Joy Business. Let's say the kind of supplies that we use, um, we have to import the raw materials to the country. Um, and most of the times it is very expensive in terms of duties and taxes. Well, we, we know that we can't blame anyone anyway, but um, um, for something like this, you will want to wish that at least it doesn't cost us much to buy them as raw materials, but it costs us so much to create them as raw materials in the country. And these are some of the things are meant for free. We are donating it, we are, uh, young business are using it. And if you have to spend so much on things like this, it makes it very innovation, very, very difficult for it to scale and be competitive. At least for this, the face marks that we did, um, hours after production is about five cities. Uh, but it could have been, been closer to about, let's say, two cities if we don't have huge taxes on the raw materials. Uh, and this will help the young innovators and startups to stay you know, uh, competitive if something like this could be dealt with. Um, but I think the, the government needs to find a middle ground between how to effectively support young innovation. I mean, uh, there could be some way, Osaki, if you are a youth, if you are a startup, and you depend on raw materials in producing your, your produce, we'll find a way of helping you reduce down on the taxes so that you can produce, then we can charge you for maybe um, VAT and all that when you, you're able to sell your product. And you pay high duties, you do your production locally, then you have to uh, um, charge VAT on it and all that. At the end, your, your, your product is very expensive. You have a markup cost of about 70% on your products, um, which makes it difficult to compete. As, as young innovators, these are some of the things that it just doesn't make business go on.